Typical of the hearings since it began, heart-rending cases are brought before the Lagos Judicial Panel of Inquiry over police brutality and the Lekki Tollgate saga. Plus TV Africa's correspondent Marichinda reports. With six cases before the panel on Tuesday, the panel chair, Justice Doris Okumobi, arrives and hearings commence. Tolulokwe is a widow whose husband was allegedly murdered by men of SARS. Hannah is next for cross-examination. She now limps after being brutalized by officers of SARS. Ruling on their cases are, however, adjourned to give the respondents' counsel time to provide more evidence. At the moment, I keep on saying we have about 210 petitions. If we had to wait till the end of the assignment, the petitioners would be frustrated waiting for a much longer period than they would expect. The decisions will come on. We don't want to make it just one. When we have a couple ready, we'll make the decisions you know, before this panel. And for those that are qualified for compensation, we would make the necessary approach. We'll make the necessary approach to the government for the compensation and it will be presented here at the panel. The other cases bother on allegations made by 64-year-old Olajide, who lost his teeth after being attacked by men of the Nigerian police, and 34-year-old Unduku Ekekwe, who broke his spinal cord after being brutalized by officers of SARS. I don't hear and deny. Please, madam, it's the panel. I'm still saying it's the panel that was set up and headed by one station at my man at my church that they did please. Please let them call with the panel. What the outcome of the panel? I didn't hear what they are uh, the outcome. So I you may be here now. Deny. Say I didn't do, I don't know you all. Please let them come. The DPO then is that if I invite him to come to say something. Has retired. Yeah, he can say something. They cannot locate him as well. The chairman of the panel adjourns to December 14. Mary Chinda reporting for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.